For centuries, Accra and Lisbon have enjoyed good relations, but both countries are yet to harness their potential to benefit their citizens. President Ekufado's three days visit to Lisbon is part of efforts to deepen the relationship. In a close meeting between the two leaders, the focus was on boosting further political, cultural, people to people exchanges and cooperation at a multilateral level and on the need to promote a better world by addressing global issues related to the attainment of the Sustainable Development Goals SDGs. At a joint news conference with President Marcelo Rebelo de Sousa, President Ekufado stated that Ghana wants to make a departure on the old economy which has been dependent on the production and export of raw materials and also dependent on aid. Ghana is not uh, just another country, African country. Ghana is a key country in Africa. You are very special, the President. I don't know if you notice it. Sometimes one gets used to his or her own personality. We are very special because most of this stability, most of this peace, most of this growth is the result of your action and of your options. The way you do not separate the political democracy from social and economic democracy. The, the aims you choose and you chose, always chose in your political life for your country, for Africa, and for the relations between Africa and Europe. Very consistent. In 1482, Elmina Castle, on the coast of the central region of Ghana, the first European trading post built on the Gulf of Guinea, and as such, the oldest European building in existence in sub-Saharan Africa, was constructed by the Portuguese. The word El Mina, as you know, means the mine in Portuguese, underscoring the historic importance of the exploitation of mineral deposits in the economy of Ghana. He further disclosed that the President of Portugal has also resolved to give voice to Ghana's cause and interests within the European Union. On global security, he stated with President Joe Biden of the United States, President Emmanuel Macron calling publicly for reforms at the UN Security Council in line with the Israeli consensus. They look forward to the leaders of the three other permanent members also supporting the reform process. We, on the other hand, will also help to facilitate the provision of a platform for enhanced economic engagement between Portugal and the member countries of ECOWAS which should boost the trade volumes and help bring prosperity to our two people. He assured President issues that Ghana will collaborate with Portugal to find solutions to challenges such as the eradication of widespread poverty, elimination of illegal migration, security and human rights violations, terrorism and violence, extremism, human and drug trafficking, piracy as well as climate change and its attendant negative impact on the environment and livelihoods. Later, the president visited Lisbon City Council and was given the keys to the city of Lisbon by the Deputy Mayor Felipe Anacoreta Correra, Edward Nyaku, reporting for GBC News.